Welcome. Today I'm going to teach you how to do a short angle forehand, which is one of the most effective shots in tennis, in my opinion, and I've used it to win many, many points. Now, a lot of people will think that getting this angle involves pointing the racket at a certain angle. That's really not going to help you to get this in. In fact, breaking the wrist and snapping it, trying to change your contact point will cause you to miss. I'm sure of this. What you need to do is keep your wrist back and we need to turn our body very, very, you know, pointing towards where we want to hit. And you'll notice that my body is pointing even off the court right now. And this is what we want because we have to point our chest to our target before we even contact the ball. Okay. And once we do this, we actually want to hit a little bit less of the ball here, right? It's not going to be a full speed shot, especially from this position in the court. What we want to do is really, really feel like we get a windshield wiper action over the ball. You need a lot of top spin for the shot to work. So you're going to have to even over exaggerate the amount of spin that you would normally hit. And you're going to do this by having an extremely loose arm and going fast with the body and your follow through instead of, you know, going through it more flat and cracking through what I call the imaginary glass pane, you're going to have a windshield wiper finish, but you're going to over exaggerate this. It's literally got to be on an angle like this because you've got to get heavy spin in order to catch this angle and make sure you don't over rotate because you'll miss this wide. You want to stop your chest, you know, I would say about here at what would be about a 45 degree angle from being completely straight. You know, my chest is parallel with the net turn 45 degrees. We want to stop our toes, hips and our chest there. Okay. Cause if you keep going, you're going to hit off balance. You're going to drag it wide. And if it does go in, it's going to be weak and you'll fall over. Right? So we want to catch ourselves at our target and then go with the arm in a windshield wiper motion to get heavy spin. Okay. Now to avoid over hitting it, you also need to lean over your front toe with your chest as you do this. So as we swing up, we have to make sure that our heels are not on the ground because this will cause us to shift our weight backwards. And no matter how much we do this, we'll probably still end up over hitting it and missing it, you know, long or wide. So from here, this is our contact point and you'll notice that's my feet and that's my head. I'm finishing with my body weight over my front toe because this will help us get leverage over the shot and get it to dip in. If you would like to learn more techniques, click the link in my description and take my free online course.